What's up, man? What's up, what's up, what's up? Yeah, so, you know your way around the kitchen? Kinda, kinda. Kinda, kinda, not really though. Nah. Not really. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. All right, yeah, so I'm peeling. All right, so I'm leading by example. I'm going to take the first one, and then you're going to help, help me out after that, right? All right. Let's talk about uh, your season this year, man. How, how you felt about how the way things went? You know, it started off, my year started off with me on the Magic. Right. Uh, I felt like it went pretty good, like, at first. I mean, we went to semis in the tip-off. We lost to the Sixers. You know, things just start happening and stuff like that. So, you know, eventually I got traded to the Grizz midway through the season. And uh, that was like, that was a really good experience for me. Like just being able to go from one place to another and like adapt to like different cultures and stuff. And I think it worked out pretty well on both ends as far as the magic getting like a uh, lockdown and to move somebody else to a different position. So let me ask you this. So you were telling me you got some history with Memphis. So how does it feel being back there? Uh, it's, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Uh, my grandparents live down there right now. So, you know, every now and then, like when we come back from New York, I'll go down and visit them and, uh, you know, just see how they're doing and stuff and get a little home cooked meals every now and then. So, it's not right. too bad. So, home cooked meals. So, tell me, what, what's the grandparents cooking down there? Oh, uh, always. They always cooking some chicken and anything to go with it mashed potatoes, green beans, all that, like the southern cooking. Yeah. That's all they do is just cook barbecue down there in Memphis. Barbecue? So, who the grill master? Granddad? Yeah, my granddad. Cool. Be careful, brother. Yeah. yeah. You need your fingers in this profession. I think I'm No, matter of fact, strong. you do this part, I'll do this part. <laughs> All right. Gotta have a little bit of onion, so. This is not your five-star fancy cooking yeah, show. Yeah. We just know, we pretty much know how much salt we want, because we eat this meal all the time, so. Yeah. Give it a little kick. So, your season high, how many points? Season high. Don't think about it, I know you know. I know you know. 28? Yeah. Who you put that up on? The Pistons. Put 28 up on the Pistons? Yeah. This is my favorite meal, man. My favorite, one of my favorite meals. See, I'm a breakfast dude, like I can yeah, eat I'm breakfast. Yeah, I'm a breakfast. The thing is, like, I don't really know how to cook a lot of dinner and lunch, but breakfast, I, I, I think I know how to cook almost everything. Guess what? You don't know how to cook dinner and lunch now because I'm putting this show up. I got tons of recipes, man. It's going to be fried lobster tails one week. It's going to be Ooh. shrimp. It's going to be fish. It's going to be so gourmet like, sandwiches. That's going to be good for the league. Like, you know, people, even people that's not in the league, but especially people that's in the league because, like, I know, like, kind of the purpose of this was, like, so you could show people, like, you know, what to cook and stuff, but, like, telling me. Like, I don't been on two different teams, and every, nobody could. I came up with the idea to do the show from watching guys in the league. Right? Yeah. I hear all the stories, everybody running the fast food restaurants, nobody really know how to cook or got the time to cook. So mm -hmm. my thing was this, and then, you know, you got a bunch of people, first time away from their mom or grandma, yeah. and they do all the cooking at home. My idea was, I'm going <coughs> to just come out with this cooking series and show the guys in the league. We could go to the grocery store, get some $6 lobster tails. Bring them home. I can show you how to make a seventy-five dollar surfing yeah, turkey. That, that's gonna save so much money because yeah. uh, even even me, I was spending money on DoorDash, Uber Eats. Let's eat. Talk to me. Tell me something. It's tough now. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Okay, it's real good. Like the potatoes top it off. That's what it is. I don't even know what to say. Nah, it's it's too good. It got that spicy. Mm -hmm. It's spicy too. And that's, no, that's probably gonna make it taste good. Make sure y'all tune in or whatever math got going on. Check out the streams. And uh, I'm gonna see y'all next time on Cooking with Coach.